So I saw a video from Nat Eliasson recently where he said he takes copies of all of his blog posts and saves the full post back in Rome where he started from. I thought it was a pretty good idea and I've tried it and it's actually a great idea. So let me show you what I mean. Um, in my Rome, when I have something I want to maybe blog about, I put the hashtag blog ideas. And then when it's published, I change the hashtag publish so it doesn't show up on that page. So for example, I can go to blog ideas here and see the eight that are still showing because they have a filter saying don't show any that are published or drafted or stuff I want to work on later. So these are just the ideas I have that I need to dig into. So when it's published, this one I published, you can see back in November of 2020. So I put the hashtag published, so it disappeared and left it at that. This is basically just a bunch of block references and then I pulled it together in WordPress and built it out there. But I'm seeing the advantage he, he's mentioned of pulling it back into Rome here and having a copy of it. So let's do that. So what I've been doing is writing a block called full content and inventing and just pasting the whole thing in here. It's the entire post I wrote over on WordPress. Now what I'll do next is um, pull in those block quotes into context. So if I ever find them later, I'll have a better idea of what is going on. So, uh, so we'll say, what if, really I can drag them down here, I guess. Um, let me stop celebrating busy. Uh, so there's that one. I can delete that up here now. Um, if it's people are too busy to think, let's see. They're being proud of busy is stupid, so let's drag that one in. So let's get that down here. Let's get rid of this weird reference from WordPress. Um, let's see what else we have. Every now and then have a little relaxation. So here's that one from Leonardo da Vinci. Let's drag that one in. And again, delete the plain text version so that doesn't show up in other searches later. Um, let's see, and then a quote from Rory Vaden. I'm not sure, yeah, there it is. There's not right to complain about others. So yep, there's that, cool. So let's drag that down. Uh, I can't quite get it here without scrolling in the video, but we'll take it in two, two chunks. <laughs> um, so I'm right to complain, so there's that. And again, we'll delete the original one here. So now later when I see these block references, they're gonna be in full context to what I had actually written about in the blog post. Um, we'll go back up, it's too busy to think, period. Um, there we go, another line from Greg. So there's that, so we'll make it a separate line. Like that in here. So we'll go ahead and indent that. Uh, there we go. This helps a little bit, and this is not a bad thing we've done already. It's it's kind of a good thing. We can talk about, I can add some more hashtags at the top now too, which I should have been doing with busyness, um, maybe focus. And then go through and maybe tag some more things in here. So Greg McKeon's book, uh, Essentialism, which is linked in the blog, was linked over to Amazon. So we're just gonna link it instead to the Essentialism page here in Rome. So it'll show up as a backlink on there. Um, and Greg McKeon will link over. Um, let's see. Um, yeah, EOS Clarity Break. So I talk about both of those. So I can say EOS is a tag and then Clarity Break um, something I have as well. So we can delete that reference to the EOS blog, which again was more useful for people on WordPress, but not as useful here. And then Leonardo da Vinci. Go ahead and link him up again. Um, yeah, and then lastly we'll take Rory Vaden, which again I linked him initially over to his website for visitors on the blog, but in here it's of more value to do that internal backlink. That's all I'm doing. I'm going back through. I only have only about 70 posts to go back through and re-add, but going forward as I post each day, I'll go ahead and save it in here this way. Um, I may leave some of my notes at the top and a few of these I've left some just notes and ideas I had, but for the most part, I'll kind of clean it out, integrate those notes, link them properly in here, add other links as needed. It should make my whole database uh, more useful as time goes on. So I hope that little tip helps and thanks Nat for uh, suggesting the idea.